for a new season in the marsh and in the mud. That's why this is protected. Four years and a half, no scratch. So, um, I've seen lately on the video, uh, people try to show the screen and to follow the numbers, and it's totally like difficult to do. And you lose your attention on the video because that moving screen. So I tried to set up a camera on the side. And first it was only one or two of those little dismal thing from GoPro and other camera. And eventually, no, 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 that's not working. It's working. Except, look, that doesn't look pretty at all. So I just removed that contraption. So I came out with another idea is this shaped piece of plastic here. So this is the look. I use the cuff. I follow, make a little table there, straight, follow the cuff. Bend a little bit, and there's a little tongue engaged in that groove right here. Okay, done. This is my counterweight with his lead. It's sliding the, the shaft here. Yeah, it, it is not pretty. It's a working machine. It's not a parade park machine or beach machine. It's a marsh machine. Now, next is to fit the camera on top. Okay. It's done. So, I just put my arm in there. See? This is the final look of the little camera arm. So yes, I go in the mud, that's why I have plastic and this kind of cover and I go on the beach and the boat. So I have those floater. But uh, uh, sometimes a difficulty in the marsh to hold the camera because my uh, I got mud in my hand. So this might help. And it can move upward, down. Also, I can swing the arm around. Here we go, like this, so it's more offset now. Uh, arm extension can swing around to be centered with the screen or offset. So if I turn this around. Okay, and turn this around. No, I'm center now with the screen. And uh, you can still see the coil over the screen. So I'm gonna go outside and make a little video with that in place. And what does it look like when it's in my hand? Just a second. Here we go. Okay, how does it fit? See the on the arm support, there's two holes there. So it engage in the hole and it click in place. Then the Velcro support the old work. There we go, in position.
And this is my counterweight, it's a lead. Okay. Now let's go outside to try it. Let's pretend I'm in the field, okay? I'm gonna try to swing normal. Not much treasure here. So what if I change the... like this? Let's see. Uh, point it back toward the machine. There we go. Now this is wide view. I can also put narrow view. My shovel. Did I kick it? What is it? What is it? I don't have my pointer, I don't have my shovel. A penny. <laughs> a penny. My first penny in my driveway. Okay. So that was for the test. And let's see. Maybe this was too dark. Maybe I did the lights on. Okay, to take this off, I remove the Velcro and I unclick this from the base and it's in my hand for a selfie. Ooh, selfie. Congratulations! Approved!